Welcome to the homework for lesson two. This is second grade module five. Write your name here first, please. And solve each addition problem using place value strategies. Use the arrow way or mental math and record your answers. And you can use scrap paper if you like. Use the back of the second page if you're using two-sided pages. So we have unit form, 500s, 510s, 400s, 510s, plus 200s. So how many hundreds are we going to have? If we've got four, we've got two, we're going to have six hundreds. And tens, we're going to have five tens, but we're not adding any more, so we still just have five tens. So that's 450, right? That's the 450. And this is the two hundreds. So we need six hundreds, five tens. That's 450 plus 200. Now when you add these together, if you're going to do this mentally, usually the way you do it, and I'm just going to explain this once and then I'm just going to rush through the rest of them. Uh, we're adding just hundreds. So usually the way you do it mentally is you look at the digits. So you're looking at this and I think I have to add 200 and 300 first. That's 500, and then you add the 20 afterwards. So add the hundreds first, and then add in the rest. And these are all going to be just adding, you know, hundreds like 500, 200, 700, 400. So this is 520. 230 plus 500, adding the hundreds, that's 700, and then the 30, 730. 200 plus 440. Well, we've got 2 and 400. That's 600. And then the 40. Looking at the hundreds here, we've got 400 and 300. That's 700. And then we have that 68. And when you're adding hundreds, you're just looking at, you see these zeros here, you know that you just have to worry about the ones and tens from the other number. So we've got 300 and 500. That's 800. And then we have the 86. So it's 800. 86, 700 and 200, that's 900, and we have the 39, so it's 939. Now we have a missing add end. So what do we have? The 19 and the 19. So we have the 19 already. We don't need to add any ones or tens. So we just need to add hundreds, and we need 400 more. Same thing here. We have 72 in this add end already. So we don't need to add any ones or tens. We just need to add hundreds. We need six hundreds more. And here we have the tens and the ones already in one of the add-ins. We just need all the hundreds, 500. Now we're doing subtraction, solving each subtraction problem using place value strategies. Use the arrow way or mental math, just like the top half of the page, except now we're doing, doing the same thing, but now we're doing it with subtraction. 500s, 8 ones, minus 300s. So we've got 500s, we're subtracting 300s, we're going to have 200s left. And we still get to keep the 8 ones. But there's no 10s in this number here. There's no 10s in our minuend. Zero 10s. We didn't subtract any. So that's 508. This is the 508. And this is the 300, is 208. 430 minus 200, subtract 200s, 230. 550 minus 300, right? We're just going to look at those hundreds digits. 200, but we get to keep that 50, so it's 250. 860 and here we have to figure out how much we had to subtract. Well, we get to keep this, we keep the 60 here, so we're not going to subtract any 10s or 1s. We're just subtracting 500s. And here we're looking just at our 100s digits. 400, and we get to keep the 28. And 718, we're subtracting 500s. So we're just looking at the 100s digit, 200, and we get to keep the 18. Same thing here, kind of. We have 800 minus 400. That's going to be 400s left, and we get to keep the 36 because we're not subtracting any 10s or 1s. 
Same thing here. We get to keep the 53, so we're only subtracting hundreds. We have to get 5 minus 4 to have 100 left. And then same thing here. We're just subtracting hundreds. So that's 9 minus 600 is 300. And here we're just looking at, we get to keep the 27, but we don't get to keep anything else. All the hundreds, we have to subtract 800. Fill in the blanks to make the true number sentences. Use place value strategies, number bonds, or the arrow way to solve. 300 more than 215. So we have 215. And we have to, we can't just do these mentally. Right here, use place value strategies, number bonds, or arrow way to solve. You've got to write it down somehow. So plus 100, 315, plus another 100, 415, plus another 100, because we need to add 300s, right? 515. Three hundred more than six hundred sixty-eight. If you wanted to use number bonds, you would do this. Think of this as six hundred, and then sixty-eight, and now you're adding three hundred plus six hundred. Nine hundred sixty-eight. Now, does this make sense? It really doesn't because <laughs> 668 isn't 300 more. Uh, I'm going to do that over. So I went backwards on that one. You got to go back and check these sometimes. So this number is more, which means that number is less. So I have to start at 668. And what I have to do is minus 100, 568, minus 100, 468, minus 100, 368. 300 more than 368 is 668. Now that sounds better. 500 less than 980. So here we go. We can look at this 980 as 980. And we're going to, we need 500 less. So that means I'm thinking 900 minus 500 equals 400. And then I'm just going to add the 400 and the 80 back together. I'm going to add the 80 back in. And this is just practice. You have to be able to write down your mental math, and this is how you do it. You show how you break up that 980 with a number bond, and then these are the two equations that you add up in your head. Something less than... 987 is 487. So we can look do this with number bonds. 900, and that's 87. This one is 487. So you're just looking at the difference between 900 and 400. Minus 400 equals 500. So 500 less than 987. For this one, we have all the numbers already. Is it 600? Is it 600 more or 600 less? 
Let's just read it. 600 more than 871 is two. No, it's not more. It's less, right? So 600 less than 871. And same thing here. We just need it either more or less. 400 more. Let's read it and see. 400 more than 444 is 844. Okay, that works. 400 more. That's what it should be.